hi guys in this video we are going to see about report properties so we are going to go to the application and see what we are going to see so here first we have the filter in this filter we have to say that our form is stable so i have selected two forms report i have selected two reports like inactive employee and active employee so i have finished my research after i send it to lid there will be seven employee I'm active now. I activate it. There will be three more employees. In case if I send this to person to the lake, it will be able to send them back. So this is the basic filter. fine next we will move on to grouping so grouping is very important thing grouping means we are going to the segmentation in the base pin i am grouping it with the short and a designation so i will put it After that, I'll send it to the lid. I'm going to see what a benchmark polished. There are also a lot of designations like a admin. You press the name of your employee and give the user name. You can change the username as you wish. You can change it to whoever you want at this time. Then click quick fill. Select your desired file. Click order sample. Select the desired design click the quick fill option click the active file and here in acquire first so in acquire one time we can use different names then next question filter is just a name like question filter here we are using designation first equal to account name just giving a name for it and i'm setting a designation here for accounts team and we are using here we are using the account name quick filter and custom filter so our invoice will be here as a pdf we are going to use templates we are going to use pdf we are not going to use templates so what we can do is we can print this printers list 
or we can give the printer summary we can show this entire details we can print pdf or save save the file so this is report properties Thank you. Let me know what you guys think about this video in the comment box. Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.